Hey there guys and welcome back to Unjaded Jade. So yeah, I'm back from Australia. What? That is why I effectively disappeared from the internet for quite a few weeks. Yeah, I was backpacking for two months up the east coast literally the best time of my entire life and the vlogs are coming your way soon don't you worry however in my time in australia i basically didn't really touch youtube at all and although it was actually so refreshing to just get off my phone get off social media and just be really present every day which i loved and i think i needed it meant that i missed out on some quality study tube content from some of my favorite creators one of my favorite things about this community guys is the community not only are you guys bloody amazing and positive and so supportive and you just make this community what it is but the YouTubers are some of my best friends. So I just thought, how cute would it be to kind of sit here and catch up on all their videos, which I was gonna do anyway, and then make a video out of it so that, hey, you guys, if you have never seen some of these YouTubers before, then you are introduced to them because the StudyTube community is amazing. And if you somehow like my videos, uh, then I am sure you will like theirs. Also, how cold is the UK? Jesus, like, I've just been wrapping up. I got off the plane and I was like, <laughs> like, what? I don't know how you guys have been doing it if you're in the UK. And the Australian sun touched my hair. Look, it's blonder, what? And that is also a very, very exciting announcement at the end of this video, so stay tuned. And don't skip ahead because I see you. I've got my tea ready and it is a green tea because I need the caffeine to cure my tired jet lag. I've got my laptop ready and I'm so excited. Let's catch up. Okay, so I don't even know where to start. Uh, okay, first in my subscriptions box right now is my good pal, Ruby Granger. And Ruby, if you're watching this, hi, I miss you. I can't wait to see you tomorrow. Oh my God, she's changed her um, channel art, her banner. Yes, Ruby, get on it. And it's just, oh, that's so Ruby, isn't it? Like the beautiful like little foliage vibes, productive, intentional living. Oh, love it. And no way, mate, 312,000 subscribers. Wow, that is well deserved, my queen, well deserved. <laughs> okay, let's see. I have watched one video, I watched it last night, and that is her live reaction to my exam results at university. Hello, it's Ruby and Deja Vu. I am going to Love look Ruby. at my exam grades. I don't know if you guys saw ages ago, but Ruby posted her exam results reaction and Unfortunately, she did not get the grades that she wanted. And she posted this, I don't know, really sad video. It was so hard to watch. But I was just like, yes, like, thank you for showing the highs and the lows. And in this video, she slays those exam results, um, which is just, oh, I don't know. Do you ever feel so invested in like other people's lives? I know that sounds, oh, that's just like the YouTube culture, isn't it? I'm so glad that she did well. Okay. Ooh, a desk tour. Let's see. I love that, a star theme. Mm. I'm going to be showing you a long-awaited desk tour. So I have not actually ever been here, and I've been here for quite a long time now, so I really should have shown you by now. But nonetheless, I really hope that you enjoy seeing how I've organised my desk. So in short, this oh, is it's pretty. my desk. I'll give you a very brief overview. She has a wooden it's spoon. Oh. The desks that we got in our university room. I'm going to start by showing you the pin board because this is the thing that I recently... I recently put together. Oh, I really want a pin board. I always see everyone's and they look so gorgeous and it just makes me makes me want one. I love astronomy and I love the night sky and so I thought that this would be quite an inspiring board for me to look at when I when I was studying. You know the sky's the limit kind of thing. Also I have got a desk. Sky's light, the limit, I love that. Which reset day in my life. Oh. Do you know watching these kind of videos makes me feel productive, like Oh, and she's wearing um, Holly's Nana tea. I love it. I have a Nana tea. If you don't have one, go get yourself one. It's just so wholesome. Reset day. <laughs> Ruby is my vegan twin, and Holly. Ooh. Ooh. 
Okay, okay, who to watch next? Uh, let's watch a bit of Eve Bennett. Oh, the snow in Oxford, I wanna see this. It looks gorgeous. Oh, ads. Do you know, I love watching Eve's vlogs just in the evening, like sitting down, getting cozy, having like some tea or something, and then you just settle in for like half an hour and just watch her week. I, I don't know, it's just nice to keep up with her. I think that's a nice thing about vlogs. You just, you just feel like you, you're part of someone's life. It's quite nice. About an app that I've worked with before and I'm working with them again, which I'm so hey, excited get that about coin, so. because it's one of my favorite apps on the market. And as a language student, really, is it Rosetta? It's just the Rosetta Stone. Rosetta Stone again. I don't know why I picked French. I think French is just sort. Of... Eve always has really good music in her vlogs. This is good music. Hey guys, so I've just had like loads of badge for dinner um, and just like eaten loads. So in the hope that like it will just keep me going. I'm not feeling great, I won't lie to you. So, which I can only do if I sleep because sleep is the best thing. So nine hours of sleep will be very useful, so. I got really ill during my travels. I feel this. I basically stayed up and partied um, like way too much. So I feel you, Eve. Get that plate of veg, mate. Got eight hours, seven and a half hours of sleep. So at least I got some sleep. Hey, the motivated tea. Yes, Eve. If you guys want to get yourself a motivated tea, link in my description. Do you know what? I love and admire how real Eve is in her vlogs. Like she's just, she's just Eve, isn't she? I feel like she just, she just doesn't hide anything. She just is who she is. And I think the internet needs more of that authenticity. So yes, Eve. Foundation, I mean, it looks a bit patchy because the concealer's not the right Um, And like just my midriff, my midriff feels massive. Like it feels, I know what, okay. Like my period is due. Like I get like body dysmorphia and I've eaten like shit for like a year. It's not big at It just feels horrible. But right now I actually feel like a heff lump. No, I don't want to go out. No, lump, mate. <sighs> Mmm, I feel this. See, I just, ah, I just really love, I just admire Eve so much because she always, she's always so honest. But I've gained so much weight while traveling because I didn't exercise and just ate rubbish like most of the time because it was cheap. But yeah, Eve, if you're watching this, mate, you're beautiful. And body dysmorphia sucks. And like, I know I can say anything and it still won't really make a difference, but yeah, you're gorgeous, mate. <laughs> She's fully vlogging on the toilet. Oh, oh. on to my good buddy, Jack Edwards. <laughs> okay, quick moment. Congratulations to Jack Edwards. I'm sorry, 100K, 100K, what? Jack is literally the loveliest human ever. He makes the most wonderful, hilarious, punny content. So this is only the first 100K of many. He deleted all his Spotify playlists and started again. What? I've got to watch this, okay. Jack basically had like, I don't even know how many, like 10 or 12 or something playlists. I followed them on Spotify, yeah. And now what, he's changed them? What? Let's uh, watch. I think I ever will come to an existential crisis. My playlist is wow. starting for retro sweets. And so, I have some pick a mix here. <gasps> Devour. Oh, is this? Oh, okay. Is this? I think, okay, was this filmed like ages ago? Was this filmed before he made the playlist initially? Cause the whole retro sweets thing is what the playlists were like. I think so. I love that he names them all after sweets. It's just it's so Jack, I love it. Maybe he's just like changed all the playlists, but the same name. Oh, I just realized I'm not screen recording anymore. <laughs> I've just been watching all this stuff and now I can't edit it in. Good on Jade, okay. Can we all just take a moment to appreciate Jack's puns? I don't think I've ever appreciated them fully in a video, so this moment right here is for Jack's puns. <laughs> so cool. Loyal Carter, so cool. <laughs> of course, there's a bit of Kendrick. This is another. These are tunes. I can't watch this and not dance. How cool that Jack knows Moss Kenner personally as well. Very cool. I saw his um, Riverdale English student reacts to Riverdale thing. 
That was very funny. Oh, he's done one to thank you next. Bubbles and bubbly. Ooh, this is a Ooh. pleasure. And now for my sister, Eve Cornwell. Ooh. Oh, okay. Oh my god. Okay, I saw she put a trailer to this video on her Instagram. If you don't know who Eve Cornwell is, why not? Just the absolute queen of editing, and she's just hilarious, and I love her. She's great. Buzzing. Oh my gosh. The colour grading, those transitions. Oh. Yes, Eve. The music. I don't want to look away because it's so beautiful, like the cinematography. Wow. Yes, get that sponsor. How does she make the tube look so good? I love that jumper. Sleep, that's cool. Oh, new vibe. I love these upside down shots as well. Ooh. Oh, it's Lemon Boy. Good song choice. Okay, so basically nothing's changed. Eve is still amazing at editing. And her videos are banging right now with the views. Yes, get it. Oh, and she hit 100k while I was away. Yes, on it. She deserves it so much. Uh, okay, I have like 20 minutes before I need to go and meet up with my friend. Mm, there's so much to catch up on. Uh, I'm just gonna have to binge later as well. Let's get a bit of Holly. Oh my gosh, what should I watch? So many good videos. Uh, I love a good day in the life. Let's watch her day in the life. Study, workout, and club with me. That's cool. Oh, I love her top. Yes, vegan twin. Snow. Why did I miss the snow? I wouldn't. I wanted to see that. Can we just appreciate how much Holly balances? I don't even know. How do you do it, Holly? Like, mate, you're amazing. She's always so positive. She always lives such like an amazing, healthy lifestyle, and yet she's balancing this crazy hard degree at Cambridge with all her like fitness dance stuff like oh you amaze me and she still has time for a social life and clubbing wow so quickly, I made pasta, like, super simple, didn't stop working when I should have done. So I'm wearing this all black outfit, which is just, you know, very me, and Oh, like, oh, the tassel black. earrings, I like them. Mm -hmm. I don't know if these are a good idea. I literally have no time, no! Uh, I'm getting carried away, okay. I'm not gonna be able to catch up all my study tube in this amount of time, no. Oh, who do I check in on? Okay, so in my head, I wanna, I wanna, I wanna watch a bit of Ibs, of course. I wanna watch V, Miss Vars. If you don't know who she is, she is just a ball of positivity and like amazing energy and she's just, oh, she's great. Lydia, what's going on with Lydia? Oh, mock exam results. Oh, I want to watch it. Four minutes. Okay, I can watch that. Come on, slay it, Lid. Firstly, in biology, I got a B. I got a B in both yes. my papers. That's so good. Normally, I B in one of the papers, and like sort of immediately. Biology A level is tough. I have history. I got an A overall. Oh my god, yes! And this is actually That's so quite good. I did just scrape an A because yes, I actually girl. got an E in one of my Tudor's essays. Wow. I haven't looked at the paper yet, and I haven't got my feedback. It's not my finest moment, but luckily the other essays that I wrote in those exams dragged my overall grade. I got exactly the same marks. On ABB, mate, that's pretty good. B. So yeah, overall I got an A and two Bs. And I'm actually really, it's looking at the moment like University of Leeds is probably going to be my Oh, I have friends at Leeds and they love it. This just reminds me how tough A-levels were. Oh, the struggle. A-levels are no joke. Oh, I miss, I miss parts of it, like oh I miss school in some ways and like being her girl and like oh I loved having my friends and seeing them every day. I don't miss the stress of it. Ah. Why is this alarm? That's... 
I have this watch that just goes off at random times, uh, but it's kind of stressing me out because I'm in a rush. Kitted out for the snow. It's kind of already started melting, so I need to get off right now. The Oxford YouTube gang. I feel like study tube, there's like branches, and the Oxford and Cambridge study tube is like a branch of study tube. They are all so genuinely lovely. Like, I feel so fortunate to call them my friends. They're just, ah. Oh. Love you guys. Okay, so I genuinely do need to go and get ready and get out of the house. But yeah, I'm gonna put a big thing, a big page on the screen with all of my friends in the StudyTube community because I am so proud to be a part of this community and these people are all amazing, making great content that is inspiring and motivational and just what, what we need on the internet, I suppose. As for um, Unjaded Jade, in the study tube community as well. Let's have a cheeky look what changes have been going on here. So yes, I made new channel art. Wow. Um, I had a burst of inspiration after coming back from traveling and I have been putting off changing my channel art for so long, like a year. And I've been wanting to change it, but I don't know, me being a perfectionist it meant that I never wanted to start because I wanted it to be perfect and I couldn't imagine how I would get it to be perfect so I just never tried. So yes, I've changed it now, proud of that. Oh, and look at that, it looks like a very controversial video title that Anjana Jade has put up. Why I wish I didn't get all these stars at GCSE and A level. Doesn't she sound ungrateful, hey? Uh, if you haven't seen that video, actually watch it instead of just reading the title because um yeah i know how that sounds uh but yeah it's about perfectionism and i'm actually quite proud of that video i filmed it and edited it in a day because i was just consumed by the idea of it that day and apart from that i've not really posted anything because i've just been away and now drum roll <laughs> <laughs> Announcement! Okay, if you've been following me and three other incredible study tubers on Instagram or Twitter social platforms, then perhaps you have an idea what this is about. There's a little thing called the wooden spoon. And no, it is not a cooking show. And no, we are not releasing our own line of spoons. Today, I would like to announce that me and Ruby and Jack and Eve Cornwell, we are releasing a podcast. What a podcast! Yeah, so isn't that, isn't that crazy? We're all in the same wonderful management. Yeah, and we were all just sat in a room and we were just chatting, got onto the idea of a podcast. We all felt so inspired and we were just brainstorming all these ideas. And I'm so buzzing about the fact that it literally is coming out in like a week or something. So surprise! Yeah, we've got a podcast called The Wooden Spoon and don't worry if that sounds like a weird name for now, um, it will make sense. <laughs> so yeah, that's the announcement. Um, thank you so much for watching this little video. It gave me an excuse to not feel bad about sitting here for like two hours and just binging videos of my friends. And now I'm gonna go meet up with a non-YouTube friend. And as for my Australia travel vlogs, they're coming. And I really, really can't wait to take you along on that adventure. Best time.